well, we hope we can sign a disagreement before the first half of this year because it's so vital for Taiwan economy. As you know, our uh, main market is Asia. It's occupying more than 65%. Uh, to China plus Hong Kong, we have 40%. And uh, to ASEAN country, 15%. In this region, we have no any agreement concerning uh, FTA. That's why we hope we can complete with China before first of this uh, the first half of this year. Then after that, we hope we can start to negotiation with Asian country and also Japan. Uh, a survey by the Mainland Affairs Council showed one in three people in Taiwan thinks Taiwan is opening up too fast. That's a lot of people. Actually, uh, Asian plus three already formed it. And uh, ASEAN with China, ASEAN with Korea, they already affected from January 1st this year. So we have to catch up. It's not the matter of too quick or too slow. It's a matter of our competition in Asian market. So that's why we have to speed up those kind of negotiation. Uh, mainland China is obviously upset that Taiwan is buying arms from the U.S. Does that make your job harder? No, I uh, don't think so, because uh, until today, we always say that we started from economic to political one, from easier one to complicated one. And uh, our negotiation in this issue will further continue after uh, Chinese Lunar New Year. One of the concerns of the opposition is that China will use the opening up not just to get an economic edge over Taiwan, but also tourists come to Taiwan as spies or companies in China hack the computers of Taiwanese companies. Is there evidence that's happening? Always you have any uh, opposition, we will take any opportunity, every opportunity to try to criticize our effort. But our effort mostly try to uh, make uh, our economy continue to grow. And uh, tourists from China is benefit from our domestic consumption. And also uh, increase of the uh, agreement between two sides will facilitate trade and investment. And if you want the economic growth, peace across trade is very vital. Longer term, where does this end up in your view? Total unification or what? No, actually, if you uh, see the government uh, poll, after our uh, opening, uh, reopen the dialogue with China and signing uh, agreement, uh, those people supporting status quo, not only continue but also enlarging. So I'm sure people is hoping that uh, through very peaceful relation with China, we can have much better economy in the future. And in other hand, we hope we can uh, make a higher quality democratic system. Let uh, Chinese people understand this is the best system. So you want free trade, but not political unification? Not, or not, of course not, of course not.